Hi, welcome to this quick demonstration of Mesh Commander. Mesh Commander is a desktop app for Windows, Linux, and PyOS. There's two main functions. First, to schedule messages, and two, to respond to key phrases. As you can see, connected to my laptop, I've got one of the LoRa devices. I'm running Linux on this uh, particular system. Um, just connect up through USB a using a data cable, run Mesh Commander, and then let's do a quick example of how it works. Now I've got several built in commands, so if you want to find out the weather, just type in hash weather. And this is on the long fast channel. It's just picked up that key phrase and it's sent back directly to the node, the weather. So it splits it up into part one and part two, depending on how big or large the text is. So it sends directly back to the node rather than the long fast channel because we don't want to clog up the long fast channel. Um, there's other examples as well. So if you want the tied information, so just type in hash tides. As you can see, yeah, it's picked up our phrase. And I sent tied information back to this particular node. He wants to respond. Oops. I think it's more my phone. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> so we got tide information. Now obviously tide information is um, and weather is down to your location. You can change the configuration within Mesh Commander. Um, I can show you a quick demo of that. So if I go into the config folder, there's a custom commands. So as I typed in earlier on, um, hash weather, you can actually edit this, change it to whatever text phrase you want and provide a change to the location where you want the weather to go to get the information from. Just have to update this. The instructions are online, uh, which will be set in the link. Um, you got news, news headlines. Also got a repeater command, which is useful for testing aerials. If you're walking around an area, an area you can send a repeat message. You also got the ability to execute set commands remotely. Now this can be handy. For example, if you've got a Raspberry Pi and you've got sensors, you can send a command to activate or deactivate. But I'll just demonstrate the repeat command, which is very useful. So you don't have to, you can send directly to the node. As long as you know the node where mesh command is running, you can, there's something wrong with my phone, <laughs> convenient, oops, okay, so if you do hash, repeat, and say repeat a test message every five seconds. I come back saying auto repeat message set to five. So every five seconds, you'll have a constant message sent back. I found this useful test in an aerial 
on my um, area. You can just set it off and you can hear it beeping every five seconds. And when it stops beeping, if you're walking on an area test in your area, then you know it's not working. Obviously, um, I've got to set the five seconds, that's a bit too frequent. And if you want to stop it, you just type in hash, repeat. If we can spell it, yeah, zero. So that will send a message back to Mesh Commander. And I'll stop. Cool, this is a, an ongoing project. Um, hope you uh, enjoy it, if you find it useful. Um, it's very handy for anything which is automated because you've got the scheduling. Um, and we can show you that scheduling side now. <clears throat> so in Mesh Commander, you can schedule to a, a, any particular node or to a channel. So I'll just show you the channel scheduling. So if you click on the channels, Mesh Commander, when you first run, will automatically generate any folder uh, with, a, with the name of whatever channel exists on it. So we're just doing a demonstration of Longfast. So in Longfast, um, if you want to schedule the message at the start of every hour, zero zero and just go and just give it a description. Uh, if you want to send a message, Quarter past the hour, 15 underscore. Underscore is a separator and another description and say half past an hour, 30 underscore and so on. So you can set it hourly, daily, monthly, anything that goes into now is sent immediately. You've got uh, one off specific dates, uh, weekly and yearly. An example here, yeah. send a message on Christmas Day at eight o'clock. So I'll put links in the description if you want to download the app for free. Um, but please donate um, and enjoy.